Today I'm going to show you how I make my grandmother's five ingredient meatloaf recipe. Now I saw Paula Dean do this once and it was amazing. Just add two slices of bread to the bottom of the pan and it helps soak up all the extra fatty juices. Then in a separate bowl, add one packet of Lipton's onion soup mix, two pounds of hamburger meat, three fourths cup of dry breadcrumbs. You can also crush up some saltine crackers here. Then one third cup of ketchup and three fourths cup of water. Now I admit I didn't count water as an ingredient in this so technically it's six ingredients. Then finally add two eggs. Now the fun begins, getting there with your hands and really mash it up. One other ingredient you may wish to use is to chop up some green bell pepper. It's also good and adds a little crunch. Now when you transfer this to your loaf pan, make sure you really press the meat down to get rid of any air pockets. For the top, I add some more ketchup. Now this is optional, but my family also loves brown sugar, and so I sprinkle some on. It adds a nice crunch. You could also mix the brown sugar with the ketchup and spread it on. Then you bake it for about an hour at 350 degrees. I usually leave mine in about an extra 10 minutes, but that's just because of my oven. Once you take it out, let it sit for 10 minutes and let the juices soak back in. And then sit back and enjoy. Thank you for following along. If you'd like to see more cooking videos, please like and subscribe and I'll see you next time.